As you can see on the screen here, I've got two footnotes, a description of one thing and something else. And when I scroll up, you can see I've got a one and then I've got a two. So that's going to be the footnotes for that sentence or that word. If this is what you're trying to do, you've clicked on the right video. Okay, I've got another example here. I'm going to add a description for the word cognac. I want to place my cursor right at the end of the word or sentence, if you prefer, and go up here to where it says reference. And then you can see in reference, we've got this one here, insert footnote. So pretty easy, adds a footnote. You can see it added the one there and then the one down here. So I'm gonna take my text and I'm just gonna paste it in here, but you can type it in if you want and then just step off of it. And that's it, that's done. You can make changes to this if you want. So if maybe I want this to be formatted different, maybe I want this text to be larger or a different color or indented, from down here, you right click on it and you go to style. Within style, you've got footnote text, you hit modify, and then within modify, you can make changes. So here I can change the font, I can change the size of it if I want, I can bold it, underline it, and you can go down here to format and click on format and make additional changes. So if you wanna change the numbering or if maybe you want to change the paragraph. So this is where you would do an indentation if you wanted to indent a bit before it posts. Uh, that is where you do that. And if when you change it and hit OK, it's going to change it for all the footnotes within the document. Additionally, notice that my one here with cognac is right here. Well, let's say I go before that and I want to add a description of peach for some reason. Click insert footnote. Notice it automatically knows the order. So it added a one for peach, it changed cognac to two, and then down here it changed the order as well in the footnote. So it will update automatically. And that's it. That's really all you need to know for adding footnotes.